gentlemen. All right, we are ready for three. There sure are a lot of people online asking about the Silva. And I'm interested to see what you guys are talking about. We'll see on Fight 19. There's a correction here. Sergio Sanchez, his actual record is one and two. One and two is his record. Is his record. For Camo, California Amateur Mixed Martial Arts Organization, he's 0 and one, and he's one and one in Mexico. Zachary Tenorio's fight is the next one. This is the co-main event right now. His is the main event. So Tenorio will be next right, after this fight. All right. I got him up live, Stephen Bonner. So as the comments come Let's in, yes, addressing the ones That's that a I brilliant can. idea, Danny. And look at that. I had to get a Sprite because the last fight made me lose my voice. And don't worry, ladies and gentlemen, this is only Sprite. Sergio Sanchez has the blue tape. And Max Red Velvet has the red tape. How fitting. Matt Red Velvet in the red corner. Max, Max Red Velvet. Max Red Velvet. Yep. That's a heck of a nickname, too. Heck of a nickname. So far, he's got, well, him. Boa. Him and the Big Nasty for nickname of the night. And Sergio the Savage. Yeah, all right, Sergio the Savage. So Sanchez and Max Gamboa. Red Velvet. Gamboa in the Red Valley Tudo shorts and Sanchez in the gray ones. Sergio Sanchez with the right hand and an uppercut. He switched stances, bombs, and switches back to orthodox. Very confusing for a fighter. But like for an amateur, that's pretty high level stuff. Sergio impressing me here. But, and, and, Red, and Max Red Velvet impressing me with his nickname. Wow, solid body shot no, 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 no. by Gamboa. What? We're wrong? That's definitely Red Velvet. Oh, just missing with the counter lead hook. Now he's switching stances too. A lot of times you see that in a fight. A guy does something to you and you want to do it right back to him. Wow, Sanchez oh. right on top of him for slipping, missing that spinning kick. Man, Sanchez has bombs. He just, he has power. He's going to... He's gonna knock a lot of people out in his career. You know, I, I like what I saw from Sanchez just a second yeah. ago. He threw like a hook and then a straight with the same hand. I like and that combo, I, it always see, works. See, when I, when I, oh, Superman Moving punch. forward, Sanchez oh. moving forward on. What I don't like about Max Red Velvet is the way he keeps his chin up. You wow, know. Wow, Gamboa landed a good right Everyone hand. says, you have the best chin, you have the best chin. Yeah, but I kept my chin down. I got hit. <laughs> yeah, but when you're definitely asking for trouble. If yes. You're fight with your chin up. Yes, yeah, see that? And Sanchez he's getting hit. Making him pay Look at him his that. face. Sanchez is making Boom. him a pain. Boom. Wow. Boom. Look at this. Solid shots coming Man. out of Sanchez. Just teeing off. Lighting red velvet up like a Christmas tree here. What a first round for Sanchez, nice. But so, I'm, I must say, Danny, a red velvet is one of my favorite cakes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the 
Replay right, right, right here, Sanchez Bomb forward, bomb! Red Velvet punches back and it doesn't even deter the Savage. He fights like a savage, that's a fitting nickname. You know, the, the, the Red Velvet, the Boom. Beard, really, Look at really that. fits that nickname as well. Yes! It looks like a, like a slice of Red but, Velvet cake. But that's shit. high level stuff. Superman punch. When you throw a Superman punch, you land with your right hand forward. And then you follow up with Lee Wright. And then another Superman lands. And then he just bombs again. Look at him slip the punch and counter. Those of you Man. listening at home, thank you for tuning in. And I'm doing what I can, responding to your questions on the live. Feed. Yes. Let's, uh, let's, let's see what they got. All right, Joe Tenorio, I'm glad you guys are loving epic fighting out there in Guam. That's important to us. Look at that, Stefan. Christmas was two months ago, but he's getting lit up like a Christmas tree. <laughs> you know? Let's go back a little bit. Let's see. I saw a question here. Samantha Beggy. These guys are letting them throw. They, they are throwing a little bit different red, than what we've seen earlier. Red Velvet has a red face from eating the punches of the savage Sergio Sanchez. Look at what he does. He throws that right hand so hard, he falls forward, and then he just starts bobbing with it. And Red Velvet obviously From the southpaw stance. A lot of fans in the crowd, they were just cheering his name. Yes, a very popular fighter here. Looks like I see a lot of very pretty ladies just cheering him on. Must Here, be the red the velvet. Must, that must be their favorite cake as he, well. He must have the magic sauce. <laughs> it's that, I'm telling you, Danny, it's that cream cheese frosting. That's right. That's what it is. That's right. But look at Matt, um, Savage, yeah, the yeah. Savage settled down a little. I wonder if all that bombing took a little out of him. Or is he just playing possum, trying to lure Red Velvet into something? Which is also some high-level psychology, psychological warfare. There you go. The Red Velvet moving forward. You know, I think Sanchez is doing a great job keeping it, keeping him at a good distance. He's do, he's very comfortable. Sanchez just looks so relaxed. And one thing Sanchez, uh, that one thing that I don't like him doing is eating leg kicks. He likes that. He Superman doesn't. Punch. He might not mind the leg kicks at all. But hey, amateurs, three minute rounds, you could eat leg kicks easier. The guy's only gonna land a half as many. Oh! Look at that Sanchez just Look at that right hand. Go. Man. Wow! Oh! 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 That was a straight groin shot. Did you see that? Look at that! Wow! Look at wow. Red Velvet doesn't even care. Lynch, he Does even not oh, give a damn. Solid right hand he, to Sanchez. Red Velvet landed the best punch of the fight for himself. My goodness. Wow, these fighters are just teeing off on each other. I Red Velvet it. coming back. Wow. Whoa. Red Velvet really Look at that. Four for that punches spin. land, and Red Velvet seems to be taking this round over. There's still 40 seconds left. But he is starting to even it out. Ooh, solid right hand from That's Sanchez. That's Sanchez. Man, when Sanchez develops a jab, he's going to be a monster. Oh my right now, he is just a right hand machine, but he throws it so hard. Wow. Man. How incredible is this? Look at that. Wow, look at that. Red Velvet, Red Velvet hurt. misses. Sanchez moving forward. Red Velvet looks a little tired, a little wobbly, but this round comes to an end. Wow. That's pretty incredible. Let's look Here at this replay go. real quick. Boom! Red Velvet <laughs> landed. It was all Sanchez's fight up until this point. And boom! Back on Sanchez. And in some of his own. Oh, that was clean. That was clean. I thought it was low. It was clean. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Boom. There's that right hand. Little big right uppercut. And then the counter there from Red Velvet. The best punch in the fight for him. Look at that. It, that was the first time Sanchez got deterred in this fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Incredible fight. I mean, I, this, this 
to be in the wedding of Friday night as well. But the last two weren't so incredible. But these guys are really letting it throw. We're not really seeing any, any crap or anything like that. It's just, Yes, let's answer questions, Danny. Danny is a former Marine. War hero. He served his country, and now he is an engineer, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> a very bright guy. I used to fight for Epic. I fought for Epic a while ago. I don't fight anymore. And he has three kids and a beautiful wife. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to see that replay. That echoed across the arena. If he doesn't have a steel cup on, I think that thing's cracked. Wow. So we have a replay right here. We here we are. Oh. Here. We have a replay right here. Look at that. Bombing. Bombing. Look at that. Those punches miss. Wild swinging, man. These guys are brawling, letting it all hang out. I, you got to love this, man. When guys, this was what it's all about. I don't care if they're not getting paid. They are putting it all on the line here. And then the groin shot heard around the world. <laughs> looking for that. Looking for that. Boom. And you see what? He's a right hand machine. He ducks yeah. his head, he launches that right hand to Sanchez. Oh, look at that. Chin up. Arm, look at him breathing with his mouth open, arms down, but he's still digging deep and firing back. He's fighting, and that's what fans love to see. Ladies and gentlemen, those of you that are just asking questions, just yes. hold on for the questions, wait in between rounds or in between fights, and we'll get to it. Here we go. They touch gloves. Sanchez and Red Velvet back in the center of the cage. Boom, they're right back in. They both got one minute to, even more than that. There was that groin shot. But uh, they're fresh. They are fresh. That's why, Danny, sometimes groin shots are a blessing in epic fights like this. Yeah. These guys are going at it. They're getting tired, rightfully so. And then a groin shot, and they get a nice break and they get to recover, and then we get some more epic fighting and epic fighting. Red Velvet attempted that high head kick. What I do like that Red Velvet's doing is working Ooh. that body late in the fight. That's the time to work it. Yeah, he is, he And is. then you go upstairs. The hands are already coming down. You're hitting the body, it'll come down even more. No, you really don't want to lift him up. You're so tired, it's hard to lift him up. Getting hit in the body, covering your body, and then open the head. Sanchez ah, moving forward. There it is. He sets everything up with that Superman oh, punch. Oh, and Red Velvet looking get, for the trip. He almost got taken down there by Red Velvet, and that would have been disastrous because this is a very close fight, yeah. and we are down to the final minute.
Man, here we go. These guys taking a little breather up against the fence. He's just but messing that, that inside thigh up of Sanchez. Red Velvet throwing some solid knees. Three or four landed. Oh! Wow. That looked clean. That was a clean, that was a clean shot. That was a clean Am shot. Am I that blind a as a bat? That was a clean shot. Or was that a clean on. shot? That Let's look clean. Please, that I beg like you. Clean shot. Production team, wow. I beg you to, to see that again. Wow, please. let us see that replay. Let us see that replay. Let's see Here it. we go, oh, look, here we go, here shot. we go. Clean here we go. Shot. The replay's on the big screen. Wow. It was hard to see from that wow. angle. It's hard to see from that angle. I could not tell from that angle. But regardless, we're back to fighting. Given, I, you wow. gotta love that about a fighter. He's given five minutes to recover, and he takes five seconds. That is a warrior, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Another epic you know, fight, Danny. Regardless, regardless of what the judges think, Red Velvet won that fight, and that was a clean knee. I, I wanna see that again. I want to see yes. that knee again because yes. that was, it was a, Let's it's see a body, it's a body shot, it dropped him. I don't know, one more time, one more time. I'm no, blind, that was, that was a, I'm blind by that angle. Let me have that last angle one more time. One more time. If we can see that, let us see that knee, that body that knee last, again. One more time, that last angle. It was close. Was that clean or was that? Illegal. Here we go. Here we go. Look at this. Look at this. Look. Boom. Body. Body. Man. Wow. It was very hard to tell. We just gotta trust the ref. Yeah. So what a fight. Though. Tough decision. Tough decision to make. Hell of a fight. Who do you have? Who do you have winning that? I got. I gotta go with my man Savage, Sergio the Savage Sanchez. In my opinion, did more damage. But it can't, I mean, that knee though, like the referee called it a low blow. From that camera angle, I could not tell. Had that been clean, fight over, fight over. 100%. And, 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 and you, know, you, know, you know what did it? You know what made the, the, the referee question? Is the first, the first low exactly. blow. If there was no low blow in the beginning, exactly. that would have been the end of the fight. Once again, a hell of a fight. And a little low blow. I don't want to say the word controversy, but I just said it. <laughs> These guys, I think, are runner-up for fight of the night. For sure, I definitely put it on there, fight of the night. Um, which, along with, <laughs> along with losing close decisions, I also have a reputation for getting second best fight of the night. Because the main event's always going to trump. Right, right. Always going to trump. And that's what we have coming up next. I mean, that was just the co And then event. I had a lot of epic fights before the fight of the night bonus was invented. Dana White says we invented that because of you. I inspired it. Really? I'm like, do I get back pay for that? <laughs> You, you definitely I will <laughs> gladly take it, Mr. White. <laughs> Let's go to some questions here. Let's scroll back yes. a little bit. Let's yes. see what we got. All right. Now that we got time. Uh, did oh, did go fight yet? Karen Darby. Uh, you can take who? Which one? Which one, Karen? Which one? Oh, Kevin. Which one, Kevin? Which one? Yeah, Kevin. Who are you talking about? I can take him. Which one are, are you, you talking, talking about? about? Red Velvet or Sanchez? And Skako is fighting fight 18. That's Why is Bonner fight. sweating so much? Because I'm a sweaty, can I say bastard yeah, on the why air? Why not? Why not? Yes. I hold the UFC record for cutting weight. They weigh you in the morning of weigh ins at 9 a.m., and then you weigh in at 4 p.m. I can cut 19 and a half pounds in those seven hours. And that's a UFC record. Seven hours? Yes. Your first judge scores it. 29, 28, Sanchez. Ah, oh, this sounds like a split. And this should be a split. Scores about 29, 28, Dan Barr. And your third judge scores it. 29, 28 for your winner. By split decision, 
and new epic bantamweight champion. Wow. Wow. Whoa, split decision. Wow. Sanchez got the W. Jeff, I hear you. I hear you. Not really sure about that decision. I hear you, but again, just like the other fight, Sanchez did. You know, I, I do give him first round, maybe the second round. And I said, that's my cousin's nickname. It's kind of cliche. There are a lot of savages, but you absolutely fought like a savage tonight. Tell us about what went through your head during that brilliant fight, Sergio. Papa. I have a bad English, bro. Look at this, man. Look at this. He's fucking beautiful, man. He's my new baby, look at this. I just wanna say, I just wanna say thank you to my coach, my family, my friends, and all my teammates. Fuck, man. Awesome. Hell of a fight, man. Hell of a belt. You know what, Sergio? You're gonna wanna wear this all the time, but don't shower in it. It messes this fuzzy part up on the inside. But you know what? Like, brilliant fight, man. He had hit you with some big shots, but your right hand is phenomenal. Is that your best weapon? Oh, thanks, man. He's, he's worked for every day. Every day in the gym, he's a fucking war like this. Oh, I'm gonna say thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Brilliant fight, Sergio, our champion, give it up for Mr. Sergio Sanchez. <laughs>